it's actually very refreshing in your thought to be able to say, hey, you know, all I got to do is make good decisions, and I don't worry about anything else. And if you make good decisions, there's no regret or worry. You can be very calm and placid in your, in your uh, uh, demeanor. Uh, I heard the statement recently, and I'm going to adopt it, worrying is praying for what you don't want to happen. Worrying is praying for what you don't want to happen. Now that says it all. And any time you, any attention you give to worrying is praying for what you don't want to happen. I just, I was thinking about how, how is that confirmed? Well, suppose you're skiing and you give your attention to all the trees and rocks that you may hit and worried about. Does that make you a good skier? Now, any coach will tell you you're supposed to visualize the right way to go down, not all the hazards that might kill you. Any attention you give to those is taking away from doing the right thing. And I'm sure any, any extreme sports person, you know, the guy who's, who's uh, free climbing on the face of Yosemite isn't saying, you know, I could fall and kill myself. I could fall and kill myself. I mean, to us, that's, what is he going to fall? Man, how the hell is he going to do it? But to him, he's, he's focusing on what's so and not what might happen. Great peace of mind in doing that. Okay, now if you if you end up still worrying, we'll just put those that same energy uh, into making a better decision. Okay, so anytime you find yourself worrying, say, you know, I can possibly improve my decision. Let's make it better. 